Uh, Paul, welcome to Swansea City. Uh, this is your first day training with your new teammates and uh, you must just be excited to get down to work and have your feet on the ground in South Wales. Yeah, definitely. Obviously a, a hectic week uh, leading up to this, but thankfully I was able to, to get here on the weekend and obviously get my first training uh, under my belt is, is huge and obviously for a big month that's coming up, uh, important to, to land uh, running on the ground. And how have you found the welcome you've received, Paul, and why was Swansea City the right club for you at this time? Yeah, the welcoming has been amazing. You know, today was my first day and, uh, you know, the, the players, the staff, uh, everyone in the club has been amazing and, and with their with their arms open for me. And so I'm super thankful and, and grateful for that. Um, yeah, and I, I think obviously coming come in, come into a club that, uh, you know, is a huge club that, that has aspirations to be in the Premier League next year. Uh, and for me, it's another opportunity. You know, this is my first time in playing in Europe. Um, and as soon as I, you know, heard that this was, this could potentially be an option, uh, there was no doubt in my mind that I wanted to be here, uh, and to help the team. And you mentioned it's been a busy week. Obviously, the move happened on deadline day. I think you were playing for the USA the same day. You scored twice against Trinidad and Tobago. And you've had a birthday to fit in between as well. So what's that been like? <laughs> yeah. Like I said, it's, it's been a hectic week and, uh, obviously the, the transfer going on on the, on the deadline day. Um, but the important thing is, is that it happened. Uh, and you know, I was able to, to play, stay healthy in the past month with the national team. Uh, and now I'm here and obviously all my, all my focus is now here on, on, on the next game and, and how I can help the team. Yeah. And how were your conversations with Steve Cooper, the head coach, you know, in terms of obviously him wanting to bring you over? Yeah, he, he's been great. You know, he, he's, he's truly been amazing to me. Um, you know, communicates great. Uh, let's me know the type of culture and, and the type of team that, that, that he has and that he wants to continue. Um, you know, and, and I thought that I would be uh, a good fit to, to come in here, um, you know, just like, just like he did. Um, so yeah, he, he, I, I have nothing but, but great things to say about uh, yeah, and you have, And you have a familiar face in the dressing room in Jordan Morris, your teammate with the US national team. Did you speak to him before you make the move? Because obviously he was going through a very similar process. Yeah, Jordan and I uh, were with the national team. We go back quite a while uh, on the national team, a few years, and uh, we had both we had both spoken about the potential move uh, earlier in the month. Obviously, we had had contact with the club, um, and we both had talked about how amazing it would be uh, to be able to be a part of the same club, especially uh, you know here in, in, in Swansea. And so, um, you know, it's it's been it's been I think a lot easier. It'll be an easier transition for me knowing that I have a familiar face. Uh, and someone who's such a such a close friend to me. So, uh, that, you know, I think I'm excited and I think it's going to go great.